Sky Profit, baby. Back with another video for you, man. Come on, man. I know I ain't got to remind you. You got to be smiling. Or at least smiling because Prophet keep on saying it over and over and over again, man. Blessings, man, always. Guidance and protection. Integrity, strength, focus, and understanding. Each individual out there, no exceptions. Never, no exceptions. Let's talk for a few minutes, man. Spirit told me hit the button. The more an individual has, the more individuals want. When you're dealing with a world that constantly makes things over and over, constantly upgrading things, constantly making different trinkets and, and different kind of things, that's on a constant. That is daily. So individuals have to realize you can't get satisfaction out of that. You can't get satisfaction with keeping up with the times. Okay? Because the more you get, the more you're going to want. The more you get, the more they're going to make. That's a process that individuals are in. You got to realize this, when you're repeating patterns, when you're repeating cycles, when you're going through the same things over and over again, spirits say it's simply called spinning your wheels. It's simply called spinning your wheels. See, spirit, God, source, creator, that's your catalyst. That's your catalyst. That's why that's what's not gonna ever change. That never gonna change. But everything else will change. You gotta understand the significance of all of these trinkets and gadgets and materialistic items, man. You have to realize that. And and profit not saying that individuals don't need none of it, don't want it, don't, you know, it's not places for some of it. Keeping up, keeping up with the times. What they say, keeping up with the what? Keeping up with the image. That's what they say, keeping up with the image. Now listen to Prophet though. This is the thing with keeping up with the image. It ain't your image and likeness. It ain't what you came with. It's something that you're picking up. So therefore, couldn't it be considered a habit? Definitely considered a habit, man. Spirit gives you satisfaction. Spirit magnetizes the things to you that gives you satisfaction. All right? Individuals has always brought these messages, brought these words. Also, individuals has always had a problem taking it in. Taking it in. It's like an individual can hear good advice from one individual and hear the exact same thing from another individual and close their ears off according to their opinion of the vessel, of the individual. You don't know the soul. You really don't know the soul. That's why these messages have to be brought. That's why it has to be known for you to move in the spirit, for you to test the spirit so you can see individuals' intentions before they even lay them out. That's what moving in the spirit is. The other night I was watching uh, the Gospel of John. I was watching the Gospel of John the other night. You know, and it was a long time ago, you know, so the level of consciousness that individuals had it wasn't it wasn't as high of a vibration like we own now. But I could just remember when I cut it off. The, through the whole movie, man, that's all Jesus kept telling them. He just kept telling them, like, you connected to me, you connected to me, you connected to the all like I'm my father. My father is me. I'm about to I'm about to go, but I'm going to be back. 
I'm coming back through the spirit. He just keep telling them this. He keep telling them this. You know, and when this woman washes feet, a lot of individuals don't even understand what that means. She washes feet with that expensive perfume. That's right. Yeah, that's right, prophet. She washes feet. And then he washed all his disciples' feet. Is that right? Yeah, prophet. Why, though? To simply let you understand. You're not different from the next individual. Source, spirit, God, creator, don't look at you different than the next individual. No exceptions is a reason Spirit Make Prophet started off with that each and every video. It's no exceptions, man. We think it's exceptions because individuals think certain things of themselves. That's the only way exceptions come in because it's opinions. It's actually opinions, okay? Just as back in the days, been bringing these messages as you're hearing one right now. But for some reason, it's hard to believe. Your soul, your soul lets you know. It's concrete. It's a definite. It resonates with you. That's what you need to hear. Your soul lets you know that. It provides that information to you. The worldly part of yourself is what overpowers that. And I'm going to tell you why. Whenever you're going to leave from wherever you're at, people going to see your vessel. They're not going to see your soul. So your soul going to always have trouble coming to the forefront because you've been walking within how individuals view you. You've been within that frame of mind. A lot of individuals have. That's all fine and dandy. Prophet make videos. I don't make videos. I don't, I'm not talking down on nobody. I'm not pointing nobody out. Like, and I'm not going to say I can care less what individuals do, but your journey is your journey. You know, and prophet journey is his. It's just simply, it's my duty. It's not my job, it's my duty to bring these messages as they've been coming in on this earth. It's individual's duty to pick it up, to gravitate to it, to embed it and make it a part of their system, their program. Manipulation is what keeps you from spirit. Manipulation is what keeps you from spirit. And I'm going to be honest with you. Everybody say Satan, devil, evil, all that. Listen, your ego is what does it most of the time. Your ego. Because your ego been walking on this earth. Everybody know your ego. Ain't nobody know you so. Everybody knows your ego, though. Every individual you come in contact with know your ego. Ego don't want to just disappear and leave like that. He just don't want to disappear and leave like that. And furthermore, a lot of individuals think that those smiles that ego give them is satisfying and anybody listening prophet say some things ain't up for discussion that shit ain't satisfying that shit make you feel like a traitor it make you feel like you ain't got it in you you ain't good enough that's what it make you feel like because it's supposed to because you're not going you're not acting accordingly prophet wants you to protect your energy protect yourself to and from watch your surroundings man watch what you're taking years watch what you give out your mouth Help somebody if you can, man. Give somebody some words of encouragement if you can. Prophet got words of encouragement. This time in your life is like no other. It's like no other, no matter how you view it. It's like no other time in your life. The way you open your eyes and feel on certain days, it's like no other time in your life. The way you open your eyes and you get to see, the things you get to see and realize and notice, is like no other time in your life. Prophet understand that. What you're supposed to be doing is simply feeling things out through your discernment and your intuition. When you're in a situation, you say, Spirit, show me what I need to see. Spirit going to show you exactly what you need to see. A lot of times is we be blind. We be blind. We don't want to see what we see. See, that's the whole thing about Jesus healing the blind man. See, y'all take it literal and it's not literal. It's not literal. Spirit going to allow you to see. Spirit is going to allow you to see. Okay? The blind, the paralyzed, that's significant. That's significant of rebirth. 
reborn. That's significant of you being resurrected into a new you. That's what it is. Till next time. Back with another video, man. Sky Prophet, baby. Ah, peace out.